Hey everyone, so it's your boy Yashve Gaming. Please like the video, share the video, and subscribe. Now, let's get straight into the video. Okay, so in this tutorial, I'm gonna teach you how you're gonna get the best out of your graphic cards. Say you do have an NVIDIA GPU, you do have an NVIDIA graphic cards. So, I'm gonna show you the uh, how how are you gonna get the best out of it, the best performance. All right, so first of all, make sure that you, uh, if you don't have this installed yet, make sure that you install it. It is uh, GeForce Experience. All right, so once you install it, just click drivers and check for updates. Make sure that you are on the latest update. Okay, so the next step is uh, you want to hover your mouse right here and you want to click this, right click, NVIDIA Control Panel. Now, if this thing does not show up into your taskbar, you can search it right here nvidia control panel okay now this is another way if you don't want to use a search button now for windows 10 users once you right click you should be able to see nvidia control panel in the thing right here but for windows 11 people for windows 11 users when you do right click you want to click show more options and then you're going to see it right here nvidia control panel click on it okay so uh it's going to take you into the configure surround and physics x all right so right here in the physics x settings i want you to select so normally it will be on auto auto select rec recommended so i want you to manually select your nvidia rtx or whatever uh, nvidia graphic cards you have okay uh Put your graphic cards right here and then click on manage 3D settings. Okay, so once you in here, I'm going to show you the best way. Okay, you don't have to image scaling, you don't need to do anything, uh, ambient occlusion, whatever. Okay, um, this one, yeah, just leave it uh, like that. And now for the background application max frame rate okay so this one is you'll have to limit the application which in your backgrounds okay limit those uh the fps i uh basically it's off turn it to on and set it to 20. okay all right and for the low latency mode set this thing to ultra max frame rate set it to on and move this thing to a thousand fps okay yeah this leave to auto and then open gl rendering gpu normally it is set on auto select so make sure that you select your uh, your graphic cards right here and power management mode normally it is set on normal so choose maximum performance okay and uh your preferred refresh rate this is very important as well choose highest available okay shader catch size leave it as driver default okay this thing i've set it to high performance it depends if you want to set it on quality you can but uh, the texture filtering I'm always gonna set on high performance it depends on whether you have a, a high-end graphic cards like any 40 uh or any rtx 40 series should be able to handle this but say if you have an rtx 30 series okay like 3080 yes even a 3080 should 3080 ti should be handled uh, high performance but say if you have like a 3060 3070 non-ti then set it to like performance or quality okay and threaded optimization set this to on okay make sure that vertical sync is off triple buffering is off and uh yeah what else this uh, leave this to uh, auto this one make sure it is off okay now you don't need to do anything okay all right so yeah 
don't worry about this um yeah just hit apply all right here hit apply now i want you to go into your change resolution make sure that uh you are not using the above resolution i'm on uh like 1440p native so i'm gonna choose the highest for me because if i set it right here watch what will happen i won't be able to get this refresh rate if i choose something like um now yeah, well, there's no uh you can, yeah you see that um right here i don't get i only get like 120 hertz if i set it like to 4k resolution i get only 60 hertz so always like your native resolution and max this out as you can see now i get three options 60 uh 60 hertz 120 hertz or 144 hertz but yeah leave it here and <coughs> what i also did i use nvidia uh nvidia color grading which is this instead of instead of the default adjust color settings okay uh yeah this i just uh, video color so i chose to go with nvidia settings i push the brightness to over 60. okay and right here for some people your dynamic range will be limited swap it to full okay and yeah so once you've done that i'm sure that you're gonna see straight away you're gonna see improvements into your performance all right give this video a thumbs up and definitely like share and comment leave me a comment if this works for you or not